The exhibition Genocide After the Genocide opened at the European Parliament in Brussels on March 1st, hosted by EU Parliament member Nicolas Andoulakis, co-organized by Research on Armenian Architecture Foundation and the European Armenian Federation for Justice and Democracy. Genocide After the Genocide consists of 32 photos of Armenian churches and religious monuments before and after 1915. It aims to show the continuous efforts of the Turkish state to clean the tangible traces of Armenians within its territory. The pictures are strong and sharp enough to explain the situation, and it is clear that no excuse, pretext, or explanation can justify the annihilation of Armenian heritage, say the organizers. Member of the European Parliament and host of the exhibition, Mr. Nicolas Andrulakis, pointed out that these exhibits are proof that the purpose of the genocide was not only the physical but also the cultural extinction of Armenians. On behalf of the co-organizers, Moses Raider Kevorkian explained that genocide after the genocide is the result of decades of research and hundreds of expeditions the Research on Armenian Architecture Foundation has made to Turkey. He also brought attention to the fact that the exhibition is proof that Turkey is in breach of international conventions, namely the Treaty of the Hag on the preservation of cultural monuments during times of war, which Turkey signed in 1965, and the International Treaty for the Preservation of Cultural Monuments monuments, which includes clear provisions for the care and preservation of cultural monuments pertaining to minorities. Turkey signed this one in 1969. The exhibition in the European Parliament will run through the 4th of March. Later in the year, it will also travel to various other European countries.